I'm Dana Roselli. Right now in your 13 Action News update, a break in the bizarre case of a three-year-old girl who has been missing for months. Police now have her father in custody. 27-year-old Ricky Beasley was taken into custody at a casino on Saturday, but the whereabouts of three-year-old Zayla Walker is still a mystery. She has been missing since August. Police are hoping that they may have been left with someone Beasley knows. He's charged with first-degree kidnapping and child abuse or neglect. Federal health officials are now extending their beef recall. They say more than 12,000 pounds of raw meat may be linked to salmonella contamination. The USDA announced the new recall this morning. They say that it includes any ground beef that was packaged between July 26th and September 7th. The products also contain EST267 inside the USDA mark of inspection. This recall comes after another beef recall was announced back in October. And today, the Fremont Street Experience is going to have their tree lighting downtown. We've been telling you about it. Well, it's at 445 today. That's when all the events kick off and Santa will be there. So good thing Santa's bundled up always. And he comes from the North Pole, Justin, so he's used to the chilly temperatures. Uh, yeah, Dana, he'll handle it just fine. But we will talk about temperatures just after dark around 5 p.m. Uh, right around 50 degrees, so make sure you are bundled up if you've got any uh, evening activities will tumble quickly down through the 40s this evening and see lows outside of the city back down to the mid 30s. The winds just barely noticeable this afternoon at about 10 to 15 miles per hour. High temperatures near 56 today, but tumbling back down to 40 degrees tonight. Dana it does look like we'll mention a, a stray shower late Wednesday, Thursday and early Friday, although really not much moisture with that system. All right, thanks so much. Well, that was your 13 Action News update. And you can find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app. Have a great day.